Dear students, the challenges of globalization have made international labor standards more relevant than ever. International labor standards are the first and the foremost about the development of people as human beings. In the declaration of Phil Ad Lafia 1944, the international community recognized that labor is not a commodity. Labor is not an inanimate product like an apple or a television set that can be negotiated for the highest profit or the lowest price. Aap dekhen, labor, laborer ko kitni value di ja rahi hai? Kaha ye ja raha hai ke laborer jo hai, ye product nahi hai, ke jis ko aap zyada profit pe bese sakte hai, ya jis ko aap kam paise pe karein, ye koi apple nahi hai, ye koi television set nahi hai. But a zabardas notion hai, but a zabardas ideology hai. What an angle, as a matter of fact. Moreover, my dear students, calm jo hai, work jo hai, it is the part of everyone's daily life and is crucial to a person's dignity, well being, and development as a human being. Calm to sabko karte hai. To calm with dignity hona chahiye, calm with respect hona chahiye, calm with social justice hona chahiye. International labor standards ka purpose ye hai ke life and dignity of men or women jo hai usko maintain kiya jaye. Decent work ka ek concept hai aur ye presume karta hai ke insaan jo hai sab ne kaam karna hai aur sab ko decent work karne ki soolat honi chahiye aisa kaam jo ke respectable ho. Decent work se murad ye hai access to productive and suitably remunerated work, safety at the workplace and social protection for families, better prospects for personal development and social integration, freedom for individual to set out their claims to organize and to participate in decisions that affect their lives and equality of opportunity and treatment for all men and women. So, decent word ki definition mein, ye jo sare features mein ne aapko bataye hai, ye shamil hai. Or international labor standards ka purpose hi yehi hai, ke decent work jo hai, wo provide kiya jai. The ILO contributes to this goal, yani decent work ke goal ke saath, by elaborating or promoting international labor standards aimed at making sure that economic growth and development go hand in hand with the creation of decent work. In this regard, my dear students, the ILO's tripartite structure ensures that these standards are backed by governments, employers and workers alike. My dear students, jo international labor standards hai, wo minimum social standards hai, jo ke agreed upon hai by the players in the global economy. International labor standards are minimum standards adopted by governments and the social partners. And it is in everyone's interest to see that for sake of social and economic justice, these rules applied across the board. Hope. You have understood the topic. Thank you very much indeed.